Okay guys, so now let's open that base.html. This is the basic index file. Uh, we will be working with this thing a lot, um, but if you know, if you're familiar with HTML, this is your index.html file, but with programming, we are gonna be able to manipulate it at any time. So uh, let's just make it an HTML file first. And I'm not going to do a whole lot with it because uh, we're actually going to change it to Twitter Bootstrap here shortly. Um, but I want to show you that it's working. So at the very base level, oops, we want to end block here. So that's the base one. That's all we're going to do for that. Um, and then open up home and we're actually going to just copy this stuff right here and Welcome and then remember how we made that form. Let's just take a look. We called it form here remember so if we called it uh, ABC we could change all the form spots and then we can go in here and call it ABC and then we'll do it as a paragraph save it and then make sure server is running so run server let's go back into our website here and welcome we have our form rendered notice the default is zero uh, email full name everything uh, unfortunately there's no way to actually send the form so we need to make it a real form by declaring so in the HTML and the action is just going to go to the same spot and the method is post so post means that it's sending it to like imagine emailing or mailing a letter you post the letter instead of getting the letter we'll discuss that later but basically in your view request post or none it's either it's going to request the post or it's not going to do anything. Uh, so in this case, we're, we're making sure that the action goes through and the method is post. And we need this CSRF, CSRF token here. This is just cross-site uh, protection. It just allows, prevents uh, bad things from happening, basically. Input type uh, equals submit so this is your submit button value equals join you can change that value to whatever you want and now we can refresh this and here we go full name is justin j j Mitchell three one two three blah 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 and you hit join and nothing happens or did it so let's go back into the admin joins there's another j Mitchell three and then one two three blah 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 now let's just double check this that it wasn't from that first time and Justin J Mitchell 3 join zip code 0 if you notice and then we go into admin joins zip code is 0 cool so it now actually works um, we have the basics of basics done and now we want to add some styling, some uh, like an actual, you know, looking website, looking landing page, but at least our form part is done. So for those of you who know HTML, know that, hey, I could just change all this stuff and it's going to look like a fully functioning um, website. And that's what we're going to do next. We're going to add some HTML and CSS and make the rest of this thing happen. All right. See you then.